Today, we're in the herd with women's basketball. Coach Aaron Rossell's troops hit the hardwood for the first time on Friday at Binghamton, and he says that he feels his team may be further along this time this year than last. Having a lot of uh, a lot of experience back is helpful. You know, I think it's maybe a little bit smoother start to practice than you know. You think back to last season with five freshmen, um, things didn't kind of. It took a while to gel, and, and not saying that we're uh, clicking on all cylinders by any stretch right now. Um, but I think it was a little bit smoother start. He says that in the early games, he thinks that it is all about his team even more than the opponent. It really is about making sure, um, you know, have we done what we were supposed to do here in the first 28 practices? And, you know, I think we, without being tested, without being, you know, seeing any results out there, I think the process so far has been really good for us. I, I think as a coach, I don't know how much I've, how often I've ever been really happy uh, at, the, at the middle of November, um, but I feel like I'm, I'm happy with where this team has progressed to uh, at this point. Senior Megan McGurk is awaiting the start to this season as much as anyone on the Bison roster. She started the first 14 games last year, but then suffered a season-ending injury. She says, though, she is ready. I feel great physically. Um, I think I'm almost back to normal, which is great. My teammates have helped me so much through the whole entire process. Um, we've really done a great job incorporating the new players. Um, we've only had one freshman on the court with us, but uh, I think she's doing a great job. And even our sophomores have done a great job transitioning from their freshman year to playing a bigger role in their sophomore year. McGurk feels that the team will not only play well at Binghamton on Friday, but at St. Joseph's on Sunday, too. Our whole entire team has worked so hard this past month and a half of practice and preseason in general, and I think we're going to have a great weekend. The Bison and Bearcats tip it off at 5.30 p.m. Friday, while the game with the Hawks is a 2 o'clock start down in Philadelphia.